My name is Dr. Kristen Kelly, and I am a surgical oncologist at Upstate Medical University. I see patients with all types of abdominal cancers, uh, anything from the stomach uh, all the way down through the colon. Uh, we also take care of patients with pancreatic and liver cancers, um, pretty much any, any cancer within the abdominal wall. We use a whole range of surgical techniques um, and match them to be appropriate for the cancer, the type of cancer that we're taking care of, as well as uh, the patient that we're taking care of. Uh, this can range from minimally invasive uh, robotics or laparoscopy all the way to an open surgery. Um, I think ultimately you have to do a good job in the procedure that you're doing, and um, so sometimes certain techniques are appropriate for that, and other times they're not, and it's our job to determine what that patient needs. I think the main thing that I want a referring physician or any patient to know about me is that um, I will give 100% to taking care of them. I think it's really important for everyone to be on the same page and to communicate with each other and for me to explain well what's going on. Um, and I'm dedicated to making sure that people understand why we're doing the treatments that we're doing. I work very closely with the medical oncologists and with the radiation oncologists. Um, I think that we need a team of people to take care of cancer patients. And so it's really important for me to help them understand kind of all the components of that team. I think often people come in and no one has ever sat down to explain to them exactly what's going on and why we're doing all the things that we're doing. Um, and a little bit of understanding uh, goes a long way in helping them cope and to fight this disease. The most rewarding patients are the ones who we end up seeing in clinic several months later who come back and feel like new people who have you know, regained some aspect of their life. And that doesn't always mean um, that they've beat their cancer necessarily, but it's just that they've been able to do something they wanted to do or um, something that you know, they wouldn't have been able to do if we hadn't helped them. And so to hear them come back later feeling better and say thank you um, is just very rewarding.